people from your side jump to my side and I have people Really? And stop saying I met you in person, girl. You pushed up on me. You made it sound like I was trying to beg to meet your ass. I, first of all, I didn't know who the fuck you were. Girl, I said, let me just throw this bitch a bone. Let her meet me. And that's what I sure did say. I sure did. You think I didn't? Bitch, I got more subjects than you. Oh. Huh. I didn't need you. I was just trying to be nice and meet people and shit. Because I'm very social. But see, niggas like you make me not want to be social. Where you at? You can come over here if you want to. You ain't come on our baby's line, so I don't know. Hold on, let me find this guy here. Shit, these bitches. Make me, but I'm still not going to give up. I may meet some nice YouTubers. And I have met some nice YouTubers. Uh, this thing is this mouse on? Uh oh, hold on. Hey, 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 face y'all, y'all. How you doing, baby? Uh huh. Hey, Yolanda, is Yolanda? Uh huh. Uh huh. I can't see. Hey, hey, so watch. I didn't know you had an actual channel. So watch. I was somewhere and I heard you talking. I had my life. I heard you talking. Mm -hmm. Okay, people are saying, okay, I can see y'all now. Mm -hmm. But, I, you know, it's it's really it's really annoying when, you know, you just try to support people and then when you feel like, you know, you give them enough support and then you just move on. I just moved on, but I didn't expect to be thrown into the goddamn mix and shit. I didn't. What the fuck did I do? Hey, Body Works, how you doing? Hey, Regina M. Hi. I can't see everybody's got in color. Yeah, Lady P. She does, and that's why I left her platform because she does too much screaming and hollering. She talks over people. She cuts off people in mid um, conversation. And those two little ladies that are on there, she disrespects them so bad. And then um, she's hooping and hollering. And then there's nothing positive. Nothing positive at all. Not even anything. And then it's like 12, 15 hour long videos and stuff. And I'm like, there's nothing positive. They're not eating a salad. They're not walking. They're just sitting there yelling and talking about shit from two, three years ago. And she has a really hate for it. Um, what's that lady's name? The California lady, um, Seven Stars. And I never really even got to know really seven stars. And a lot of other people I have not really gotten to know. But then because I'm over there, it looks like I'm a part of that posse. And I'm not a part of anybody's posse. Mm -mm. So this seven stars lady, I've seen a whole bunch of shit about her. But then I see some things that I can understand because there's nobody's life is perfect. Nobody's life is perfect. And bitch, I got a lot of stuff in my life. And everybody does. So, but every chance she gets, she always talk about this. She just gets onto the soapbox and just talk about people. And I just got tired of it. So I just stopped going over there. And I guess a lot of the other people did. And all that hooping and hollering and yelling and crying and damn, it was just way too much. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Miss Mimi. How you doing, baby? Hey, boo. Mm -hmm. But I'm not, you know, and I said, when I was got off um, iBay's live, I said, I'm not going, I'm going to go live tonight, but I'm not going to talk about it. But the more I saw other things and I kept replaying it, I was like, this whole really got me motherfucking twisted. And I don't want y'all to, what I don't what want y'all to do is have whole thing bad shit about y'all. Well, what is this? I didn't mean, Get me a better um, hotspot. Katie, Katie, Robin. Well, this sister. You know what I'm right. saying? And the second thing is love unconditionally. God say, don't be Christ. Be Christ like, do the best you can by right. your sister. Treat folks like you want to be treated. Politics, I'm right. telling you, these guys, I'm going to tell you, they are so 
propaganda, you know, when it comes to politics, they tell you anything. But the time they get up in the White House, they're always going to raise the damn taxes. He knows this. So why is yeah. it we always going to sit here and make ourselves sick, get depressed over some bunch of political shit? America need to get back down to America. We had days like Ronald Reagan, Jimmy Carter, Abraham Lincoln. We need to put that, you know? So, um, yeah. I got a lot of people here. here. I a lot got of people here. here. And, so, I think, well, and then one, one more prerequisite I'm going to say coming from, you know, one of the backbones of the army is this. If a military, if a, if a head of the chief of command, if the president have not been in the military, at least a minimum of 20 years, I don't think he should. Thank I can you. hear what the fuck to do. I do agree off. with that. You need to have some military background to be running yeah. president of the United States. Yeah, being a businessman and then you don't even pay your goddamn bills and taxes and things. I you were not right. qualified I, to run for president. Of the I United was States. hoping Colin Powell would have went for it. Oh my goodness! No, my boss and him were none of part of that bullshit. Just as already. I know. I was about my first duty station was in Fort Worth, Texas. Seventeen years old and. General Swartz and Colonel Powell, Colin Powell were general Colin Powell at the time. Um, I was his driver. I was a little young, me five. They weren't going to give me shit because I had to learn my way as the NCO boy. They put the person dressing on my ass. I learned how to jump out of planes, learned how to repel. They sent me to the hardcore school. You think, uh, y'all remember that movie with uh, Demi Moore? When she was yeah. trying with the next girls. That's me. Many sisters in, in these groups because it's a man's army. Honey, when you get ranked like that, you have no gender. And it's right. the most hardest thing in the world because I can't tell you how many times my ugly ass has got sex with her ass and I have to tell a motherfucker to go kill himself. Being yeah. a of, I work for my like I'm not I'm not a whore. <laughs> so you see things like that because you can't you can't you can't let bullshit put you back when you're in the and, and and so you know this that you gotta be strong as a military spouse. And I know you gotta yeah, watch out for the jokies too, though. Precisely, honey. Get that shit right on there. So, you know, because yeah. they, they will destroy everything. Exactly. Well, you know, okay, what have you been doing, honey? What you been up to besides slaying motherfuckers, you know? And it's not cussing up because the kids might be. I gotta look at this. Besides, this is one of the Chris Views channel, so I'm gonna respect her. She's going. Okay. Now, do you do you, do you do uh, videos on your platform? Me? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, honey. I'm a creator. We well, need to go and check you out. Well, you got me. Just find my channel because you know I I did a a document. Doug, well, I did. I won't say doc. I did an upload. My father had the old footage of when he was in the military, and I played it on my TV. But I did mm -hmm. a little things added to it by Martin Luther King. I got about six or seven of them up here. So check me out. I cook. Um, I'm a people's channel. So that means I don't know what my nick is. Hell, I'm a people nick. People first love people. So I'm not here in the network. But, you know, when it comes to YouTube, and I do have a little affiliation with them. They're major. I'm not the owner, but, you know, I do what I do as far as, you know, production. Um, I'm head of the security, homeland security team. Well, a couple of these channels. I mean, I mean, not just channels of YouTube. We're talking about Google. You know, um, when you White House communication, you're you're a that's a lie. I say that, guys, because of this. Oh, this is awesome to see, and definitely I will share it with the people that watch me. I definitely will. Oh, this is awesome. Can, working can, right? can you put yeah. your link down in the uh, comment section? I think I already got you. Bro. I'm doing a stream yard and again. She over here multitasking. I ain't mad at somebody you just doing it. You know what I, I think I enjoyed the most was that Miss Pam has calmed down. Oh, good, Miss Pam. Oh, yeah. You know, look, look, at, look at the expression on her face. Yeah. <laughs> there we go, guys. All right. Yeah, but uh, my channel is more a people channel because I do whatever I want. So I'll cook and you know, just enjoy at home. Just be me. Mm-hmm. That's, that's it. What, that's what I do too. Um, I don't have a nickname. 
I don't have a niche or anything. I just shoot from there. Well, it'd be right to. It it took me someplace else. Yeah, we all need that right now at this time. We all re- we need that. to be calmed down. Exactly. Calm down. <laughs> You know, what I, we got people freaking out. So what I've been doing is going around and putting cases of MREs on people's front porch. Just mm-hmm. my name is my channel, baby. Just uh, just yeah. Yeah, that's what we need now. The world needs more love than anything else, you know. We we gotta come together as a mighty force. We're the baddest uh, USA is the baddest place to be, you know. And one thing you gotta be thankful for. <laughs> From where the places I've been, America, women, I tell you guys, you know, people overseas, men treated women like shit, places like Iraq, and they yeah. beat the hell out of them, cut their heads off, and stuff like that. And, you know, when they put the women in the back of the car, they treat women like shit over there, anywhere. United States, boy, we got it going on because we can slap the hell out of husband. You go there and slap your husband, they got the right to kill you. So, you know, I tell people, yeah. I tell people about you complain about living in America. You come roll with me to places I've been overseas. You'll cry yourself a real thank God. And that's why, you know, I sit back and sometimes I say, sometimes a lot of us Americans, we get spoiled. We don't realize how fortunate we have. And that's why we got to vote, get out there and represent about our views, not by the color of our skin, but the most valuable things that means your generation or my generation. Because I'm telling yeah. you, you know, with politics, the wrong president can make us as well as I had out Hitler to kill his own damn people in the Jew. Feel me? I'm just using that as an example of my history. So, you know, history repeats itself. We allow it to. That's why we got to come together and show love to one another. Because, you know, the United States, we don't want to die. Yeah. 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 But anyway, yeah, but you know, you guys know what I'm saying. We get the yes. comments. We really do. Mm-hmm. And then uh, the other thing we want are people are forging the prices, which really makes me sick. Hey, did y'all know we're going to get $1,400? The stimulus check should be arriving sometime between this week and as late as as the month you're getting my check. I got a couple people told me they got that shit already. You know, like uh, the big dogs that work in the apartments. They know they're going to get it anyway. And then a lot of things, I'm saying something. Don't believe that I have all this shit, this political fighting. These fools leave home at the end of the day, their best friends. They already know going to be the president for the next seven years. I can tell you that. Yeah. So when you sit here and see Donald Trump and Joe Biden fighting, trust me, believe me, they ain't going to last as long as only for political show because I've told you guys know it's new fiscal year. Old money got to make new money. And people think when the uh, the government shuts down, they really shutting down. They don't know they're just taking a break because they know they got to get the money right. Yeah. And when a, a president goes in office, they got this thing called purge. They got to purge IRS with the COVID-19. Right now, the epidemic is you be using your favor. You feel a little Donald Trump. You can't go out and spend all the stimulus money and think, because, you know, with the COVID-19, anything can happen. You have another shutdown state by state, city by city, because that's not controlled by the federal. That's controlled by state. So, you know, mm-hmm. I tell you guys, you get your stimulus check, you know, do what you got to do. I can't tell you how to spend your money. No, you can't. And then I'm what I like to do is uh, next uh, weekend, like after the um, after um, Biden has been elected, um, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and probably set up a streamyard uh, premiere. I would love for you uh, both to come back and discuss what had happened after the after Biden has gotten into office, and then uh, what he is actually he's uh, he's already shared what he wants to put on the table for us. So that he can, re- uh, so that we can get the economy back going, and to make people, um, I don't want to say make people understand what the hell had happened, but I need him to, uh, to teach us or tell us what the fuck the goddamn fucking orange man did because he did a lot of cock blocking. So I'm, see, I see, I know, I want to know the hide behind. Orange man, I, don't I want, know. I want you to know. come back tonight and um, have another conversation. Oh. Right. After this whole thing is going, and actually maybe have an ongoing conversation, at maybe like every week or something, like 20 days, 30 days into this, because uh, we don't know what he's doing now, because he's still in office, so he's doing all the behind the scenes shit, 
Some of those people kind of fuckery that it, the goddamn oh, orange guys is going to make it um, very awkward for um, for Biden to uh, complete his first. See, this is disrespectful. He's been very disrespectful. But yeah, for him to, yeah. to go ahead and do this transition properly. We already know he's doing it. We already know we, we're seeing it. He asked us motherfuckers to come to the goddamn Capitol. He yeah. invited them. So the, the only um, thing I know for sure is the Cheeto dude is part of the name of Little Wayne. That's the I only saw thing that Little Wayne is another person. Like like really I saw that. He is part right, of the you guys, What are your personal views about Nancy Pelosi? Um I think well she annoys me, but at least she's there. She's fighting. Um, she's uh, somewhere down the line. Do you believe that her and Donald Trump had an affair somewhere down the line? Yeah, I can. I believe they fucked. I I sure you that. You're damn right. Yeah, yeah so they fucked. I think she needs to sit down after this one, but she's thinking they, they, they're saying that she may be able to do another one. This one, of course, another one. But she needs to sit her ass down. I feel for Jesus. I I don't give a shit. Don't nobody deserve to be hurt or scared, you know, from all of this. Y'all see what they did at her office? They you know, don't know. Crazy. They had machetes ready to go out though. If you watch the, uh, today's show, I don't know what is that, Gail. I don't know what show she's on, but I was Gail King. Moment. Yes, you know, Oprah's old friend. Uh -huh. uh, she did a um, interview with uh, Nancy Pelosi. That's what also show what they did to a computer. They had machetes. They called the guy down in South Carolina that was a part of it. I want to tell you guys, I didn't have a, I got it on my email, and uh, someone sent me. They called him. So I'm glad they called him. Yeah. He had bombs and everything in his car ready to blow everything up. Well, they went in there with zip tags, bombs, guns, yes. everything. They put in there with all that shit. And then, and then and first of all, first of all, they want to be pardoned. They want to say, oh, well, the president invited us. Like, really? Like, when I invite people over to visit me, uh, uh, what's her name? A uh, goddess. I hope you ain't bring no gun and no goddamn bombs and shit. Like, oh, no, that's right. Like, I'm going to invite people, you know, like, people over to your spot, and then you go, they're going to bring guns and bombs and shit. I'm being really facetious when I say something like that. I'm just, I'm yeah, just I'm using it as an example. Like, how are you gonna bring? He, he said they said that he, uh, Trump invited motherfuckers over here. To, oh, oh, so that's you had the guns and the knife, and you broke it, and they had inside out because that one bitch. I don't even know if y'all know this. I don't have no idea why these women up in this goddamn situation. The one woman was sitting at the goddamn bottom of the window, giving directions on where to go to get to people's offices and stuff. I don't know if y'all saw that. Okay, whose office we wanted the senator, the president, or the senator of Minnesota? Okay, go down the hallway, knock on the door, drop down on face, knock on door fifty four. That's his office. This is, I'm like, they, they planned that shit. Be God, um, I was telling Regina, thank you. Uh, Regina, oh, I want to one thing. I'm sorry. Uh, can I say one thing, Miss View? And I want to I want to say Regina back to the stimulus, and I said it was coming this week. If you keep in mind, you remember the six hundred dollars stimulus checks were coming out. IRS already, IRS, not IRS, but it's, the Treasury had already had them pre ready to go, and then they said fourteen hundred dollars. So the two thousand dollars that Donald Trump had signed him and Joe Biden campaign when he was acting like a prick because he found out he lost the election, they collaborated because all the heads of the Republicans and the Democrats begged Donald Trump, and they finally when they Went to what was the shutdown? I think the second shutdown before the Simmons check came out, it was ready to go. So I got an inside source saying that it, I know that the $1,400 so is becoming sometime this week. A trust reliable source that I know told me that it should be starting today. Don't hold me for it, but I what yeah, that's not, I, I I have it by Friday. You got direct deposit. Mm -hmm. That text is another thing. Already people are saying that their Simmons checks are going to different accounts. Somebody don't use a, uh, well, a lot of my soldiers told me that they didn't get theirs because somebody I, uh, compromised their identity. Uh, they got to go into bank accounts, but I know the IRS had put it out to the military that they're going to fund it back. 
You don't get it back. You guys ain't got your stimulus check. You got one card off your sleeve. It's called taxes. File your taxes, you'll get all your money right then. The more you got, I'm gonna make it. It's gonna rain, baby. You know, I can't tell you how you spend your money, but use it wisely because you don't know when this epidemic is gonna move to uh, uh, go in. Because look at all the people with the unemployment, guys. They are still got people out there. Hungry. $1,400 is not going to help some of these people. It's not. That's, and I wish they would gave more. But something is better than nothing. So be wise with it. That's all I'm going to say. Well, I'm going to do that. But, uh, you know, I, I pray that God is prosperous to everybody. Get all the money that you need to pay your bills. You know, keep it pushing. You know what I'm saying? Because it's all for everybody. You know, so I think Kamala's going to be our first woman, African-American woman president. I don't think Biden is going to... Um, I don't wish him harm, but... Um, I don't think he's going to last. I know I just changed the topic. She does. I'm sorry, I just changed the topic. But, you know, when it's your platform, you can do that. There you go, girl. So, yeah, that, what do you all think about that? Again, I don't think he has the charisma. He doesn't have the health and he definitely doesn't have the social skills that she has. Well, he doesn't have the strength because he's old now. He's old now. Yeah, that's what I meant by health. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think he picked I think he picked a great running mate. I think he did. Yeah. Well, Donna, yeah, I'm, so sorry. Yeah, one, thing that I'm sorry too, Donna. I was reading your uh thing on that you had your yeah. Test. Like, I agree, Yolanda is Yolanda. Mm -hmm. yeah. I love your people, Yolanda. They're awesome, honey. Oh, yeah, they all have opinions. They are very educated, and they like to they like to comment on to them, and so, yeah, I do that. Yeah, mm -hmm. I love looking at the chat because you see what's going on and things that I don't know. I, I love learning things from anyone. If you got something to share with me, I'm going to read on it. Knowledge yeah, is key. Yes. That knowledge pass it on because right. if you can't pass it on to someone else. So thank you so much, Jennifer, and for me. Because that was so I got, I'm gonna get this dog on for seven dollars. My motor just blowed in my car. Thank you, Lord, for stepping up. But you know, I don't want to count all my eggs before they get in my bank account. So okay, I'm gonna sit back and like, okay. But uh we're gonna get that money though. I pray there's more. You know, because we've got I'm thinking it's gonna be more. I'm, I'm thinking it's gonna be the 2K, but you know, we don't, we don't won't see it until it's actually on the table because they've been yeah, saying. Right now, I don't know the proposal out. I don't know. If it's been finally approved, and um, so we're gonna get the fourteen hundred dollars. I know that the unemployment is extended. I think uh, Regina could correct me if I'm wrong. To October, November, no September, right before the new fiscal year. So mm -hmm. I do know that. Okay, well, I'm going to wrap this live up, and then I'm going to do the last five minutes. It's 11.54, and so um, i got to go to work tomorrow. I got class in once. Thank you. It's been a pleasure. Anytime. Um, I mean, I'm here, baby. Just give me a link. He's there. Thank you. I appreciate it. And, and, the, and my viewers are appreciating it, too, because you've given us some information that uh, right. we didn't know. So it's great. Thank I appreciate you. it. They informed me. Thank you so much. Well, guys, um, you guys have a blessed evening. Love you, you guys. So much. Oh, she's asking, do you have IG? IG? What is IG? Instagram. Instagram, Instagram yes. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. <laughs> but I say what I, I say what I'll get out there when I uh, when I get off here. I'll send you guys the link to your. Uh, okay. Because what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and subscribe to you, uh, Star. You yeah. have all my personal information, so okay, great. All right, we can say right. Love you guys. Be blessed. Right. Love you guys. Everyone be blessed. Love you so much. Love you so much. Have right, a nice thank you. Be blessed. All right. Bye. Thank you. Good night. All right. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. And, uh, mm -hmm. All right. All right. Uh, thank you all for watching. I um I initially came on with a different agenda, um, but it's always <coughs> nice. Um, she's still in the background, Miss Stacy Little. You're still in the background, but I'm not going to do anything. Uh, I'm just going to kick you from the studio. <laughs> there you go.
there you go. People keep me from the studio all the time because uh, I asked for it because uh, I don't know how to exit gracefully. Um, I came in because I was very upset at um, seeing somebody uh, say that I was a fake, um, somebody that I had entertained and um, shared in my personal space. Um, I have no idea why they did that. Um, and I'm talking about uh, Miss Goddess. I, I didn't do anything to you. I don't know why you felt comfortable enough to um, add me into your uh, dislike or disdain for, or disdain for Miss Mona. Um, I think you need to get past it. I have and a lot of others have. And you can't tell other people what to do and where to go on their platform and their channel. You can't do that. And you definitely can't do that to me. You could probably do that to the two people that you have that are there, your supporters. You can do that. The two ladies that you have on your platform. But you cannot do that to me. Okay? Little girl, you can't do that to me. All right. And I thought you were totally disrespectful to me. I may let you know how she felt. The other ladies probably give two fucks to the goddamn wind. But listen here, girl. If you clap back at me with this shit, baby, I, I am nice. And I, I do have blood pressure medicine pills. But you just don't say anything back to me. Goddess, do not clap back to me with this. I am... Oh, where's the goddamn thing? Don't say nothing back to me. Do not. You fucked up and you said something about me and I don't like you were in my situation, in my environment, in the place that I stayed at. I don't stay there anymore. I stay two floors down, okay? Don't say shit else about me. I'm telling you. I'm not asking. No, ma'am. I'm not asking at all. Telling you, don't say shit else about me. The fucking nerve of your motherfucking monkey ass. Y'all bitches gonna think I'm nice. I ain't fucking nice. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm trying to calm down and stay calm and shit. But some of these raggedy motherfuckers just feel comfortable. Bitch, you are fucking easy read. You always don't hear goddamn wine in this shit. It's your fucked up hair, and you are fat, and your fucking makeup is horrible. Sure is. You look like a fucking bozo the clown. You gonna tell somebody about something? You gonna tell Brianna about her weed color? And you got that goddamn pink goddamn yarn in your goddamn hair. Huh? Now, now you just somebody, girl. You got on pink. You, you, so, you, you, you probably not clap back at me. Okay. I'm just saying. I love your life. I baby. didn't come real ass. Ass. You feel comfortable sipping whatever the fuck you was sipping in that goddamn cup, bitch. Damn. Don't, don't fuck with me. Just don't. Yeah, I'm yeah. just telling you. I am not asking. I am telling you. That's that. Little that motherfucker would. You fuck with all the other motherfuckers that you out here fucking with already. I don't know nothing about all that motherfucking fuck shit. Bitch. I don't got time for y'all motherfuckers no more. I don't work at the church no more. Okay? Fuck the church. This is right. God damn the church. I am gonna calm down. I'm a goddamn silly. I'm gonna shit this. Off. Guys, I love y'all. <laughs> but you know what? If I'm gonna do it, I should do it to my own self. I'm not saying this. She was with, I love this girl. She view with a view. You like her? Give a thumbs down. You love me? Should I have this content? Come on, guys. I'm Muslim. I'm maybe Christian. I come like Satan. You know how I'm a black folk. Full star. I like her. She keeps 100. And what the world needs now is the truth. Now, this is a live stream. Not mine. But thank you, guys. I had a good time on a platform. And my favorite color is black. I'm going to have a sweet sex. Love you. Bye-bye. I got to fuck off.
Peace. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikumsalam. Don't let me read.